In the last 100 days, I've had the great privilege of showcasing the beauty, the potentials, and the immense opportunity that Southeast has to offer, particularly in the area of lifestyle and real estate. And this entire journey was worth every bit of it. Hey there, it's your girl Abby of Southeast, and I'm super elated to officially announce the completion of our 100 days challenge. But let's quickly do a recap and reflect on the journey so far. So, first, we explored Enugu, showcasing great real estate development in prime locations like WUTC Estate, Zoo Estate. Fidelity Estate and so many more. We also went for that to experience hiking in Ikiriki Hills, which was very adventurous. And we taught Shop Ride, Spa Mall, and various parts of Enugu for you to see, and also gave you a full overview of what Enugu looks like in 2024. And from there, I visited Anambra and showcased awesome developments such as Ngozika Estates, Solution Fun City, and even Dubai Estates in Oka. I also took a tour around Oka Millennium City and provided a sneak peek of what Oka looks like today. Next, we journeyed to Imo States as we toured the beautiful Obita Lake and experienced the calmness of Crystal Lake Resorts. We also visited Bowery Mall and showcased the luxurious living options available in the state, like Udemwa Estate and so many more. Of course, we also showed you what Google looks like today. While in Eboy Estate, I uncovered unique attractions like the Rice Fox Mountain, the Chippy Mill in Abakili Key, the popular St. Margaret International Market, and the beautiful Eboy Estate Shopping Mall. I also visited Camp David Estate in Abakiliki, Eboy State International Airport, Eboy State University, and we also went further to show you an overview of what the state looks like. Travel wasn't all. I also gave educating details on the 67% cumulative increase on the internally generated revenue of these southeastern states, showcasing the region's economic growth. I also went for that to explain how Nigerians in diaspora can buy land right here in Southeast Nigeria and key into strategic locations like Enugu, Anambra, Oweri, and so on. I provided detailed insights of the difference between acres and hectares, offered guidance on choosing the right building materials like doors, tiles, roofing sheets, plumbing materials, and so much more. I didn't just stop there. I explored the vibrant Abia State that holds a lot of great historical background and visited iconic locations like the National War Museum, Ariaria International Market, and even Ojupi's Bunker in Umwahia. Additionally, I showcased the recent development in Abia State, explored the prestigious Abia Poly, and did an overview of what the state looks like currently. Having explored these five southeastern states in the last 100 days, it has become really evident that the media isn't doing enough to showcase the beauty and the tremendous growth in southeast Nigeria. The rapid development, the rich cultural heritage, and investment opportunities right here in southeast Nigeria are truly astonishing. Don't sleep on it. So if you missed any of the videos, there is actually a lot to catch up with. Make sure you stay glued to this channel, hit the subscribe button, turn on your notifications for more exciting videos. And if you're looking at buying genuine lands and houses right here in South East Nigeria, call me on 90 9963 The front of this challenge is finally a wrap! <laughs> I'm super grateful for every single one of you for joining through this 100 days challenge with me. See, if I did not go crazy in this last 100 days, I would never go crazy in my entire life 
guys we did it wow see you in my next video bye